Welcome back to this video. My name is Rafi Yakub right here. And in this video, I'm going to show you on how to add custom font in Excel workbook. So let's see. All right, so the very first thing you want to do is to open up your web browser. So after you open up your web browser, and then you have to come to the address bar right here. What you need to do is to simply type in that font and then press enter. And it's automatically take you to the Google search page. Next thing you need to do is to simply click on the first result right here, and it's take you to the official web page of thatfont.com. You can simply scroll down and then see which type of font you want to download. Like for instance, I love this particular font right here, Trends. What I need to do is to simply come right here. I will click on, uh, click on download right here, and in a few seconds, our download file is going to be prepared and successfully downloaded in the zip folder. Next thing we want to do is to access from the web browser, and head over to our download folder and see how we can unzip, install, and use the font in our Excel workbook. So let's find out. All right, so the next thing we want to do now is to head over to my download folder. So right here, we have my download folder right here. So I'm going to simply click on it. And then uh, we have the font here in the zip folder. Next thing we want to do is to bring out an, another folder where we can transfer this file to. So I have my font folder right here, which I'm going to simply bring it out. So here we go. I will just drag it for one side right here. And then I will come back to the zip file. I will drag from here and take it to the font empty folder right here. Now the next thing I'm going to do is to come back right here. Right click on it, on the font name. Then I will click on extract here. So in a few seconds, we have the font extracted. Next thing we want to do is to double click on the font. And this is going to pump up. Then we can scroll down and check on the preview of the font. Once we satisfy with the font, next thing we want to do is to simply come to the top right here, click on install. And in a few seconds, the font has been successfully installed. Now let's see how we can apply this font in our Excel workbook. So I'm going to simply minimize and bring out my Excel workbook right here. Now from here, we can simply select the shell that we want to change the font. Then what next thing we want to do is to simply navigate to the font type right here. Then we come to the font right here, and then I can simply type the name of the font, which is trend. So the font is still loaded up. So we have the font name to be trend. Or better still, I can simply scroll down and then see the font right here. So trend st trend okay so just like what you see right here we have the font right here now and the uh, trends so i can click on it and it automatically appear on the on the shell right here as you can see right here it has been reflected so if i come back to the next colon right here and i come back to my type right here and i type trend again trends and i press enter you can see the font become active in the in the section so i come here again and i come back here i type trends so that's just the name of the font you have it right here i can come here and reduce the font size everything depends on what you really want to achieve as far as custom font is concerned so it's as simple as that so basically this is how to add custom font in microsoft excel workbook without any slides i hope you really got value for this video if you find this video useful Give this video a big like and also remember to subscribe to the channel for more useful tutorial like this. Thank you so much for watching and I hope to see you in my next video. Bye for now.